All right, so I actually went ahead and looked this up online, and from what I understand, we did need that levy stone thingy that we got, and we got to go down here. There's some sort of thing down there. So, and this person is totally on the bridge, which is awesome. Come on, person. Yeah, thank you. Somebody should have thought of that, that people are going to be blocking freaking bridges and stuff when they program this. I know it was a long time ago, but I can still be bitter. All right, so let's try to figure out our route. It looks like we're going to have to kind of like just take the first left pretty much when we get out into the water here. See how this goes. And yeah, there's a little thing down here. This might work out. Oh, and I could have just walked straight down instead of going all the way around there. Good to know. But, yeah, the game definitely didn't really give me any direction here. Um, I would have just had to wander around aimlessly, I guess. Which isn't so bad, but I'm not going to waste my time. We live in modern day, and I can just go and look it up on the internet. No sense struggling and, and being sad and confused. Mostly not doing that because I don't want to have a lot of spoilers, because I am enjoying this game, and... and seeing where it's going and stuff but every so often something like that comes up where it's just like I have no freaking clue what you want me to do man but from what I understand this might work out I was a little concerned there I was like did I go to the right place but I think we did there's definitely a lot of angry enemies here if that means anything oh man they got the first hits in worked over again. I always like it better when we get to strike first and just wipe out some dudes, but they can't, they ran away. That's the first time anybody's run away in a while. I don't think anybody's run away at all, actually. I didn't even cast any sort of fear thing. Hmm. I guess we're just scary. Now, who got hurt? You got hurt. I'll heal you. Everybody kind of got a little bit hurt. We might have all wanted to run away. I would have saved you a little bit of trouble here, man. I don't like fleeing. I ain't running away. Bunch of freaking cowardly snakes. It's about time some of these enemies get a little bit smart and be like, holy crap, these guys are a little bit too powerful for us. Alright, good. The cutscene did trigger like they said it would. And now I actually don't know where we're going to be going after this, so... That's about that for now. Oh, so that weird looking thing was actually the levee stone. The little diamondy shaped thing. This is an epic cutscene. It must have been very epic on the NES. Oh, it's an airship. Cool. So I, th I heard it was... Wow, it's kind of a silly looking airship. I guess airships are always kind of silly looking. I don't know what it is with Japanese people and airships, but like... Mario's got airships, this has got airships. There's a lot of airships in Japanese video games for some reason, which... I don't really understand. And they're not like Zeppelins or anything. They're always like these kind of like literal ships. Like a boat. It's very odd. Well, that is kind of illogical, in my opinion. Why was this airship here? Alright, let's get on this bad boy. Oh, whoa! Look at the map change perspective there. Holy crap, this thing is fast. I am going to need to figure out where we're going before we go too much further. Have I been to this? Yeah, this is all the starter stuff, so I don't think I have to worry about really any of that right now. From what I understand, there is um, some extra stuff we can do, like, I forgot what they call it, but there is a little bit of extra stuff we can do. Have I been to this place? I don't know if I recognize that place. Is that... That's a starting area, so I guess... I guess I have been there. That's probably that stupid cave. Alright, so, I guess we'll set a course for for this over here. Let's see what's going on. Actually, I like this little island better. Let's go to this one. So I need to fly like over yonder, over this, 
This is gonna be hard to navigate because I definitely can't like particularly tell where I am. Alright, that's the starting town, Cornelia or whatever. Well, this is really nice. I'm not gonna be taking a boat anywhere anymore. Now I don't know where I am though. Alright, we're almost there. We're right, they're actually pretty much on course here. How do I land this thing? Do I just press X or something? Let's scout around a little bit, I guess. Not much going on over there. Alright, here's a town. And then there was something over here, like a cave or a desert, I guess. Hmm. Alright, well, let's go check out this town if I can find it again. So can I just plop down any old place? I can't. No, I cannot. Um, where can I land? Can I land here? Well, this is going to be a learning experience. Um, there's no trees right right there. Nope, still can't do it. Is that the hold X? Nope. Um, well, this is a field, right? Nope. Where the heck do you want me to land? There, we can land there because there's absolutely nothing there. All right. Well, that's a good learning experience. I knew they wouldn't make it quite that easy that you just feel a land right where you want to go, but... It's been a while since we ran into these dudes. Hellhounds, I, I probably shouldn't have used fire against them, but it likely won't matter in the end very much anyway. That was kind of dumb, I wasn't really thinking. They're probably weak to, to ice or something. Oh well. It didn't matter. Yay, I level up. Oh my god. I have at least one more rant yep, one more random battle at least before we get to where we're going. That airship is gonna improve our lives so much. I don't remember what these guys are weak to, but here you go. I remember they hurt pretty bad. I remember that very well. Yeah, poor little Zock over there. Oh, that was decent damage, I guess. Go, go, everyone! Just spaz out. Let's check out. What are we at? Ornrak? Hmm. Is there even a town here? Well, there's somebody over here. Let's go talk to this person. Look at my legs. Aren't they wonderful? Well, they're alright, I guess. I love having legs. Look, look. Did you see the move I just did? What it? Why are you so excited to have legs? That Underhill fellow from the car caravan. Had something awful weird for sale. Um, stay still so I can talk to you. Out of me way, son of a hick. I haven't been able to catch me a single fish. That's really sad. I don't really care though. Does anybody here have anything useful to say? Used to be a beautiful village until 200 years ago. Hmm. Yeah, kind of. It's fairly crappy now. See a gravestone. Uh, none of the, not many of these gravestones particularly have anything interesting to say, do they? So is there anything here? There's some sort of building. Let's see what we got going on here. Is this just the yeah, this is the revival place. Don't need you right now. Hopefully not again. You ever hear of something called Oxiel? No. They say that the shrine sank into the sea two hundred years ago. Now there are mermaids Oh, that would explain the leg thing. That would probably explain why she likes her. You're a mermaid. You are a former mermaid, I think. A little aerial stuff going on here. I'm not ashamed to admit I really like that movie, The Little Mermaid. Um, it's probably like, I don't know, five of them. And probably like, I already have a bunch, so I'm just going to buy nine more. I don't know. Remedy. 
Cures ailments except for... Well, that's kind of expensive, though. These cottages cost a lot, too. Man, you guys. Kind of raking me over the coals here. A little bit of extortion going on. 